Just a tremendous year for us. We went 25 and seven, went to the national tournament. We lost in the Elite Eight, um, but great for us to represent Niagara County Community College in the men's basketball program. A lot of the credit is due to our continuity and chemistry. Having guys back that's been part of the program and having guys that really sacrificed a lot for each other and a lot of their own things uh, to help us be successful. Our coaches award winner this year is gonna be Adam McNeil. Just did a multitude of things as far as a teammate goes, uh, sacrificing his own time for other teammates, uh, being able to get in here and just as a, from a coach's standpoint and just work with me every single day. Always on an even keel, really proud of the work that he did here. He came here because he wanted to earn a scholarship and, and he, he, he's done that now and will be taking that trip down to St. Thomas in Miami, Florida. 3.98 GPA, he, he couldn't get much better. I know him and another student, uh, Talik, are pretty upset about the A- minus they got. Jamal Polydor is this year's MVP. You know, he's a kid that averaged four points per game the year before, questioned on really coming back, and, and we wanted him back. And, and what he needed to do would just become more aware of our schemes and strategies and fit that in with the skills of scoring the ball like he had. He was first team all region, region three player of the year, um, and district player of the year. And this year's MVP deserves it, the bucket. Yeah, really excited to have some of these guys back. Danell Cuthart was, was huge for us this year. Probably second in our MVP choices. Um, average 14, six, and three as a freshman. Uh, tremendous guy to build around, along with Najee Scott, Titania Mixon, the Terrence Reed, and, and of course, uh, the big guy, 6'11", 245, Chris Luke, has made some great games this year. Yeah, we're trying to find guys that fit with those guys. I think that's the important, you know, they have to fit with those guys that we have got coming back. I want to take another step. I want to win 30 games next year. I want to get past the Elite Eight and Nationals. I think our experience will help us out in those aspects. I think it's a coach's, you know, you had, it's a quick turnaround at the junior college, but I think this is the right place to do it.